Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back. So, I was supposed to make a daily video for Legends Red Knights today, but I actually, I, I fucked up really, really badly. Like, I actually just talked for like a whole 20 minutes and forgot to record it, basically. <laughs> and I pretty much already did, went through and did everything that I needed to do today. But um, there's actually one really important thing that I actually wanted to talk about, and that's actually just a little tip. It's, it's kind of a little tip video just for you guys. Um, this is the best way to, to gain gold. So, um, I don't know if you guys want, want to do this. It's a little bit of an investment, but I think in the long run, it definitely does pay off. So, I'm going to show you guys, um, like, uh, my, my Lara right now. So, basically, this is my, my Lara, my main, um, my main unit that I use for the game. Like, there's really no reason that um, I, I would not use her when I'm leveling when I, or when I'm farming stages because she she is my attacker, she farms a lot faster, she does everything a lot better than my other units because she has her, all her skills leveled up and everything. Um, but the, the problem is that there's... well, not there's not an actual problem, but there's, uh, there's a reason why it might be better to use my Ashley or my Vashu to farm certain stages, especially stages that are easier. So, if you look right here, uh, my Lara does have a, a, a gear that has a Dina gain increased by 9%, and this is the reason why you might want to use some other units in the game. So, if you look at my Vashu here, like my Vashu has a really, really insane set. Um, he has an, an axe that increases Athena gain by 22%, a headband by, uh, that increases it by 18%, and a chest that increases it by 24%. I actually got this to plus 6 just to just to get this, you know, so um, I don't think I'll upgrade this anymore. I don't really care if it's cursed or anything like that, so it's, it's, still, it's still really, really good. Um, but anyways, I just wanted to show you guys a difference. The difference between farming um, with my Vashu and farming with my Lara. Like the amount of gold that I actually get. So we're going to do two runs. There is an Elder event going on right now. And um, the the gold gain like from from the set or, or from your gear actually does affect the, the drop of the Elder. So I'll, I'll, I'm, I was farming this just now. I'm going to do two runs of this. One for, uh, one run with just my Lara, and then I'm going to do a second run with my Vashu. And hopefully in the two runs, um, the Elder doesn't spawn, or maybe the Elder does spawn. If the Elder does spawn, I'll, I'll try to show two runs where the Elder does spawn or when the Elder doesn't spawn. Um, and this is especially helpful right now because there is the Elder event going on right now. So, a lot of people people might think that the Elder, uh, the gold gain from the Elder actually isn't affected by the the actual the, the actual gear set or your your gear bonus, um, but I'm I'm actually here to show you that it's it actually does affect it. So, so the Elder did spawn, and he he's got yeah he's dropped a bit of gold. By kiln should be around like 900 or something. Actually no, it's a thousand five hundred. Alright, still not, still not that much. It's, it, I mean, it's pretty nice, pretty nice. A thousand five hundred gold, extra gold, on whenever you're farming is is definitely somewhat helpful. All right, come on, just die, just die, so I can get my gold. All right, so we're gonna do a second run. Hopefully. Um, the elder does spawn again, so I can make a comparison. If it doesn't spawn, I'll I'll try to do a run where the elder does and try to try to run it again um, to to make the elder spawn. So if you look at it right right here, just remember the numbers: uh, 983 gold from here and 1,553 gold from the elder. So I'm going to retry the stage, and this time I'm going to use my Vashu, who has a gold gain set that actually you know gives him more gold. Um, I've in total, the three pieces give him about around 30, or not 30, uh, 64 percent. Yeah, in total, 64 percent gold. And this is probably the one of the like the highest I can get it to, because um, the the actual stat, the stat that gives you bonus gold, it only appears on your headpiece, chest piece, and weapon. So you can't get it on any other gear. Um, I've I've checked. I basically went through all my gear. I checked um, reforging as well. You can't reforge into into that gear either. Alright, so the the elder didn't spawn, so we're probably gonna have to do another run um, just to just te th test things out. I'm not sure if I should use my transformation if it'll make things faster 
but they'll slow things down. Because if I transform, it, the animation is, is a lot longer, but then he does a lot more damage if I transform, so I might as well do it. Man, this trans transformation is so damn sweet. It's kind of a shame how Vashu is so bad like compared to the other two heroes. But I think that in itself isn't all bad. Alright, but if you look over here, you'll notice that I basically almost have double the gold. Um, the du double the gold gain. I'm not sure if it's additive or multi multiplicative. It might possibly be multiplicative, or maybe I just have better luck. Basically, it was like a thousand gold, and now I have like, you know, it's it's not always going to be a thousand gold, but it might it might have been a luckier drop. Maybe I, and before the bonus, um, before the bonus, actually the calculation for the bonus went in. Maybe I got like a thousand one hundred, and then sixty four percent of that is is the extra eight hundred. Um, so we're gonna do another run. Hopefully the elder does spawn, and that, then this way I can show you that there's a there's a gold difference, you know. I'm just a lazy asshole. Like you know, this 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 could have been two minutes. I'm too lazy to edit, so I'm gonna have to show you live. This is fantasy uncut, but I'm always uncut. I'm gonna wait for Vashu to use his nuke before I tra do the transformation. Alright, use your nuke. Alright, nice, we got the Elder to spawn. Right, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna use my transformation and we're gonna just hit him really, really hard. Alright, so um, the gold is actually added in here right now. But you'll see at the end of the stage, they actually separate the gold gain from the Elder with the gold gain of the stage. But the bonus of your your set is actually still effective um, at the end of the stage. You'll see, like, my Lara got, like, around 1,500. And it, it, it was around 1,500 here. So if you if you just look at the gold right here, it's already t it's around 2,500. Um, maybe after you kill the boss, it becomes, like, 3,000. But then it won't add up because I'll definitely get a lot more gold than that. So just just look at this. I got 2,600, and that's the bonus from the the actual um, the, the set that I have on my Bashu. So yeah, that's. I think this is a definitely a more effective way to farm. Like just have more gold gain on your gear, and you don't necessarily need to use your strongest hero when you're just farming because most of the stages that you you already cleared then you, you can probably already clear it already and if you're farming a really hard stage that you can't clear then you obviously can't use this method um so that yeah that's pretty much it that's one of the reasons why i decided to raise my vashi i was using my ashley earlier um but she doesn't have as much like she still has a decent amount of um gold gain i actually reforced this one to make it into gold gain and um, I decided to actually switch to my Vashu because he, he literally has like the most insane amount of gold gain possible. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's basically how, I, how I've been farming up. Um, and if you found this video helpful, definitely, um, definitely stick around and watch the next one. Alright, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.